Hi, folks, it's Ron. When drilling holes in electrical boxes, you know what? I have a better way here. In this video, we'll take a look at the TKO carbide tipped hole cutters from Ideal. Electrical contractors know what a time consuming chore it can be cutting holes in electrical boxes when wiring electrical circuits. The TKO cutters offer the most efficient and clean cutting replacement for traditional knockout hole punches. By making smooth holes in a fraction of time and at a fraction of the cost. And they're available from 3 quarter inch all the way up to 4 and a half inch hole sizes. The DKO saves time and cuts clean holes. Take a look at this comparison. Drilling a 1 and 1 eighth inch hole only takes about 30 seconds with the TKO, where a competitor's knockout tool takes over 6 minutes by the time you drill the pilot hole, assemble the knockout, and actually punch out the hole. With carbide tips specifically designed to cut sheet metal, TKO cutters will even cut stainless steel, maintaining a clean, sharp edge over extended use. Regular mild steel is bad enough, but stainless steel enclosures are known for being very difficult to work with. Normally, something like that you'd have to sub out to a separate shop that has the right tools for dealing with stainless. The carbide tips cut through stainless steel and outperform high-speed steel cutters and bimetal hole saws in mild steel by a mile. And if you're used to using bimetal hole saws, the TKO is a completely different experience, cutting through boxes smoothly and with an improved degree of control. Carbide's toughness and hard metal characteristics provide a tough, long-lasting cutter that leaves a professional, quality hole. The innovative design includes the exclusive Smooth Start Replacement Pilot Drill, which has a split point tip to prevent walking and a tapered design which guides the cutter to the surface avoiding cutter damage. The ejection spring easily ejects the slug and the integrated arbor provides a cleaner, more accurate hole by reducing vibration commonly experienced in hole saws using a separate arbor. It also has an overdrill flange which prevents cutter penetration beyond the sheet metal so the cutter will not damage existing wiring in a panel. Here are some tips when using the TKO carbide hole cutters. Tip one is to drill at slower speeds compared to a regular bimetal hole saw. Faster is not better with the TKO. Depending on the hole size and type of material, the RPM of the drill should range between 100 to 500 RPM. A good rule of thumb is to keep it in a low to medium speed to prevent any damage to the cutter. Check the minimum RPM and torque of the drill you are using against the recommended RPM chart provided with the cutter. Tip two is to keep the cutter head flat to the work and do not rock the hole cutter. The idea here is to keep the load evenly distributed to avoid any impact on one tooth. This can chip the carbide cutting teeth and does not help it go any faster. It is not a bimetal hole saw, guys. Tip three is when cutting stainless steel, it's recommended to use cutting oil to help lubricate and cool the cutting edge. And in any material, do not apply unnecessary force. And as always, let the cutting blades do the work. Following these tips will increase the TKO's hole cutter's ability to do its job, save you time in the field, and prolong the life of your cutter. When it comes to quality, performance, and durability, Ideal is professional's choice. To learn more about the line of TKO carbide tipped hole cutters, call our customer service department or visit our website to find a distributor nearby. Hey, thanks for watching, folks. I'm Ron with Ideal.